Hello YouTube, welcome to iCode and today we're going to be linking buttons in Unity. So first what you want to do, download the assets in the description down below and make sure to hit that subscribe button, make sure to give this video a like. Um, once you've done that, go to game object UI button and duplicate this button like three times, okay? So you should have four buttons right now. And then go to canvas, instead of constant pixel size, scale with screen size, change that. Okay, let me go to main camera. I'm gonna change my camera so you guys can see it. All right, about that, that looks good. All right, let's go to the first button and let's name it Facebook. And let's drag the Facebook sprite. Okay, let's go to the text in the button, let's say Facebook. All right, let's go to the next button and let's name it YouTube. Let's drag the YouTube sprite, YouTube. Okay, next, the text, let's change to YouTube. Okay, let's go to the next button and let's name it um, Twitter. And let's drag the Twitter logo. Okay, let's go to the text and let's type in Twitter. All right, let's go to the last button. Let's drag the Instagram sprite. And let's name it Instagram. And let's go to text and type in Instagram. Okay, now what we want to do is let's separate these buttons and let's scale them where they look nice. All right, the Facebook button is going to go all the way over here to the left. Um, Let's scale it down a bit. Hi, okay. That looks good. Let's drag that the text. Let's move the text to the top. All right, right there. Let's go to the YouTube button. Let's drag it all the way to the right. Let's size it up a bit. All right, let's move the text to the top. All right, let's go to the Twitter button. Let's have it right here. Let's move the height. Let's bring the width down a bit. Actually, let's put the Twitter button right here. And let's um, move the text to the top. Okay, let's go to the last button, which is our Instagram button. Let's scale it up. All right, let's move it right here. Okay, now let's move the text to the top. All right, now let's create a script to make all these buttons work. Go to create C sharp. And let's name it link. All right, let's open the script up. Okay, let's erase these void. We don't need these. Let's create our own void. Public void. Face book. Parentheses. We're going to say um application dot open URL. Parentheses. Double quotations. All right. Let's duplicate this. Copy paste paste. All right, now let's change this to Twitter. Let's change this to Instagram. And let's change this to YouTube. All right, now let's go get the URLs we want to put. Let's see that closes that. Okay, so now let's get the URLs. All right, I'm gonna use the actual YouTube URL. But I'm going to put the actual YouTube URL for YouTube, and then I'm going to put the actual URL for Facebook. All right, let me copy Twitter. We need the Twitter URL. Copy. Instagram. Copy. Paste. All right, let's save this. Go to File. Save. Or let's go back to our scene. Uh, now what we want to do, go to Canvas. Let's drag this script into the Canvas. Let's go to Facebook. Let's click the plus sign right here. Let's drag our canvas because that's where we put the script. Let's drag our canvas into here. Then no function. We want to choose our script name, which is called link. And then this is Facebook. All right, let's do that for the others. Click the plus sign, drag the canvas, find the script, and then find the actual name, which is YouTube for this one. Then Twitter, canvas, link, Twitter. Last but not least, Instagram, Canvas, Link. All right, now once we click play, it should open up the links we put. So if I click Facebook, it should open up Facebook. If I click Instagram, it should open up Instagram. Twitter should open up Twitter. And YouTube should open up YouTube. All right, thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up.